So we will now perform an examination of your eye movements and subsequently of the vestibular system. And I will begin with your head position because there are many disorders which lead to a deviation or to a head tilt. And subsequently, I look at your eyes. In particular, look for a deviation of the eyes. Then I do the cover test, cover one eye, remove the cover, cover the other eye, remove the cover, cover this eye, remove the cover. And then you can look at the eye which is not covered or the eye which had been covered to look for inward or outward movements or for a vertical divergence. And the most sensitive test is the alternating cover test. Then you can see the maximum angle of eye deviation. And it's important that you cover the eyes for a few seconds. Don't move too quickly. Okay. And now look at my finger to the left, to the right, as far as you can look, and up. And down, look at my finger. Then we can also check the diagonal positions. Look here, left downward, and right downward, and upward, and upward here. OK, look straight ahead. And now look at the finger, which moves up, left, right, as quick as you can. Right, left, right, and up, and down, and up, and down, and up, and down, and up. And now look straight ahead. Now look here at my finger, fixate my finger. Can you see both fingers? Yes. Okay. Now look here. Fixate my finger. This is an examination for the so-called Gacy Vogue nystagmus. Now look up, 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 up. Fixate my finger. Okay, now look down. Have a close look at my finger. Fixate my finger. Now we examine so-called smooth pursuit eye movements. And we check if they're really smooth or saccadic. Okay, perfect. Now look here, now fix it. Here, and there, and there. This is the convergence reaction. And there, and here, and there. Now look at the finger. And now up here again. Once again, look at my finger. Fix it, fix it, fix it. And now look. The next step is an examination of the optokinetic nystagmus, which is a very useful test in particular in children or in patients who have difficulties to cooperate, patients with a reduced consciousness. Very good. And now fixate the figures on the drum as good as you can. The other way, fixate. Very good. Okay. Now the last time, have a close look at the figures. Okay, now look straight ahead. Thank you.